I can explode it and keep the others busy. Place the derrick. We got enough to cover it, Sally. Yes, but it won't leave us much in the bank. You sure the casing and machinery are all right? Yeah, we went over everything, and there were only a few broken fittings. The crew is straightening out everything now. Then I'll tell the association members we're starting up again. Good idea. They're plenty worried. <laughs> Can't blame them. I've gone broke wildcatting wells myself several times. All I have to do is start over again. But if this cooperative venture fails, it means our friends and neighbors are broke, too. Well, we can still make it if we don't have any more trouble. And I'm going to be on guard day and night from now on. I'll let you know how we make out. Goodbye. Goodbye. Good morning, Ward. Hello, Dawson. Drink up, Rusty. Time to go. Why, did the stuff come in? Yeah, got into Benton on this morning's freight. We're going to meet the wagon there and ride with it to the rig. So you're going to rebuild the derrick and try again? That's right. Well, good luck to you, Ward. But remember, if you find that you haven't got the time to exercise your lease option, remember my offer to buy you out still stands. As a matter of fact, it might be wiser if you sold your lease now rather than risk losing everything. Well, we still expect to finish the well in time even though someone around here seems mighty anxious to stop us. Come on, Rusty. Ride out and tell Hacker to come to my office at once. Okay. Just talking to Ward Gordon. They're bringing a wagon load of material in from Benton today for the new derrick. Ward and Rusty are riding with it. They're a tough pair to tackle. So you'll take plenty of men with you. It's important to destroy that material because I don't think that the association can afford any more expenses. You seem to know an awful lot about their business. Ain't you afraid that Ward might get wise to you? I think he suspects me already. But what can he prove? I spend most of my time here in this office. Nobody sees you come here, I'm safe. Sure, you're in the clear, but we're not so safe. I think we'll wear masks today. Good. We've got to be careful for a while. But once we get a well-organized gang, we'll run things to suit ourselves. I hope so. Yeah, the rest of the boys are over in the trees waiting for your signal. All right, we'll draw the guard off first. Looks like a trick to draw us away from the wagon. We'll pretend to follow them. You stay here. Away. 
We'll get the others. got enough. You can't expect a man to fight dynamite even for the kind of money Dawson pays. That sure fixed him. Yeah, but we can't always be so lucky. As soon as we get this stuff to the well, I'm going to try to find out who's behind all this. Reed, I want to talk to you. Don't try to jump on me about that shooting. It was self-defense. That's not what I want to talk about. The sheriff just brought in the bodies of the men who were killed attacking our wagon. One of them was your pal, Cody. What's that got to do with me? You were a good friend of his. Maybe you can tell me who he was working for. I'm not telling you nothing. Then I'm taking you to the sheriff and charging you with being one of the men who attacked the wagon. Come on. You're not taking me anywhere. I said, come on. <laughs> Are you ready to talk to me or the sheriff? This is none of my business, Ward, but I know Reed fairly well. Maybe I can help you. I'd sure appreciate it. If you know who Cody was working with, you'd better tell him. Tell him the truth. I mean it. Well, all I know is he was with a couple of fellas named Hacker and Larson. They got a camp up in Calico Canyon. All right. But if I don't find them there, I'll be back to see you again. Thanks, Dawson. It's all right, boy. I don't get this. Hacker and Larson really are up in Calico Canyon. Of course they are. You can cut across country and get there before he does, can't you? Yeah, I guess so, but I still don't get it. If Hacker and Larson are waiting for Ward when he rides in, It'll be a good chance to get rid of him permanently. Yeah, I see. I'll be on my way. Ward's on his way here. Here? How'd he find out about this place? I told him. The boss ordered me to. 
You fellas are to take care of him when he gets here. Okay, how soon? Any time now. All right, we'll handle him. You better stay out of this. Suits me. Damn it. 